Hey everyone, welcome back to our channel. I'm Shruti. And I'm Dre. And together we are Beauty and the Beard. So today we're watching Vinland Saga. <laughs> So today we're starting Vinland Saga Season 1, Episode 1, Somewhere, Not Here. Not here. Let's get it going. Let's do it. Cornfield. Alright, bro. <laughs> oh, somebody Ooh, just woke up. This guy is huge. He's shaped, shaped like Thanos. Yeah. Oh, look at our two girls. Thors. Thors. Sick! Helga and Thor, of course. <gasps> what happened? He's... <gasps> oh, he's about to die. He's having memories, Dre. I don't think he's about to die. I don't think he's about to die. I can tell right now. <gasps> wow! Oh! I fucking rode up the thing. Against you two. Bruh. All these guys are against them two, you think? <laughs> I dozed off! <gasps> he's, baby, he's using the guy as a shield. Remember he said that? <laughs> oh shit. Oh, about that life, huh? oh. Sword and fucking Wow! Not sure how that but ended, but I'm got guessing. Got lightning. I'm guessing. Hail. Hail. He's seen his wife too. Shit. Oh no! He didn't, try to hide. he didn't flinch. Over the bolt. Too. He took wow. his sword. How did right? he fucking get momentum underwater? Bro, what kind of strength is that? The thing's not even in this chest. Mm -hmm. I feel like that was somebody big he just killed. So you get tired and that's uh, nice to know you're human. Jesus Christ. Oh my goodness. Who survived that shit? I just see one set of footprints. <laughs> the simple life. Mm -hmm. One thousand and two in Iceland. That baby Thor. Ah, Thorfinn, Hitzi no Isato ga ochichi mo onegai. Oh! Oh! The man can squeeze a teeth. Milk. What the fuck? Okay. You see. Look almost like he saw us calling or something. Right? He's a man of the sea. もっと豊かな土地がある。風が Wow. wow, that looks amazing. Skoshiaminaustaga, <laughs> 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 Shin no Sen Shi Dake ga 
やっぱおっちゃんはすごいなだってじいちゃんが言ってたもん西にはヨルムンガンドがいて近づく船をみんな止めてるんだそれでその先は何にもないんだわあ。そういうのはファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファイターにファ Nobody said it but you. Top of the warrior. <laughs> you thought beat some sense into them. <laughs> I like this. Very small. Chains. This guy didn't make it from the ships. Yeah, it seems like it. Greenland on it. ことしの寒波も厳しくなる。だが問題なのは年を追うごとに寒さが厳しくなることだ。ゴーストクストロンボイ。僕はさな。いずれ誰も越せぬような冬が来るかもしれん。わしの国では。ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ドルフィン。ドルフィン船長なんだキャプテンと。ああ、ドリーミング。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。ああ。I'm the one who wore this bed. Uh oh. Oh, here's something. Wow. I'm going to get a little bit of a little bit of a The Horgamon took him again. Wow. 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 <laughs> A person. The guy. <sighs> he almost made it to the front of our lives. Oh. ハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ
ら僕のご先祖様が逃げたりするもんか、うん、こっちゃのバーカー冒険じじいおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおおあんた、ひだ、いるわ、もっと強く。あ、は、はい。あんた、どこから来たんだ。あ、ハーブだ。やっぱり、山の向こうから。あ,あそこは嫌だ。嫌だ。どこにも。行くあてなんか奴ら奴隷がどうとか言って強引に上陸しやがったレイフさんが間に入ってくれてるが今にも若かしゅうとにかく鎖は人間に似合う唯一の首飾りだ金でも銀でもねえ鉄の鎖だそう思わんか You've got an evil face, bro. That's evil animation at its finest. Cut his chin, eh? His iron chain. Hmm. Oh. 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 Which one? Oh, what? That was the mark across the guy's chest. It was the iron chain. Oh my god. Baby, you know how much hair it ripped out? That was. Oh my god. Oh, the guy's dying. Thorfinn's like, what the fuck did my dad do? It's all our food? <laughs> oh, he's oh, <laughs> done right after. Did he just give him a proper burial or something? Aurora Borealis. Why did she do that? Why did she do that? Why did she do that? そう伝えられているどこに行くのおおメインキャラクターわあ、look at that dude ホーリーシッ looks like that guy from looks like Wolverine and Colossus the military Gaia Gaia that's what he looks like that's right yeah exactly his fighting stance and military pants what's in there a special sword That's kind of wrapped like the handle one That's the sword that was in the water, babe. That's right. That's the guy he fought in the water. He's coming back for revenge. Let's go back and see that first fight. Let's go back to see that shit right now. Pretty sure that's. It made us see that that thing hit the bottom of the ocean for a reason. It's true. It's true. Yeah. They're very distinct in showing us that. Oh, man. Oh, man. Oh my 
goodness gracious. What a first episode. Yo. Man sold all his sheep for a dead man. That was crazy. And I, I, I'm honest, that's it. Well, I want to see his ideology, you know? Like, he seems like... That's the thing. He's obviously the... He's obviously the fucking... Uh, the shield and the spear for these people. But, like, he clearly is caring, considerate, kind-hearted. But he also has a family, right? Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay, 987. That's the year 987. So he jumps across a few boats. Okay, this is the okay. It's the water fight. Okay. He drops hand on his chest. Took you so. It has like a fist on it. The bottom of his, the handle of his sword. Okay, now and now we go back to the end of the episode because <laughs> I like the, the the pattern. I thought it was a bit woven, but anyway. So that blade, guy is mean? one of the the you know that the handle of the blade. Mm -hmm. Let's check it out. So many like little storylines, like half Dan Thor, Thorfinn's curiosity, the sisters like the sisters wanting of a slave. The, uh, we need a slave, or else I gotta work. I, you know, type of shit. I don't want to clean snow. That is, uh, and what did they do with the slave? I, I didn't see anything about burial or, I mean, I don't know what they do they, with, they didn't show in the Viking times, but. Maybe they're at the top of the mountain because they, they, you know, they sail the body off into the water. I don't know. No, it's a different handle. No, that's it. It's, they see, okay, it's woven. You saw that? That's it. Yeah, it's woven yeah. and not just straight across. That's what I thought was different. And the bottom piece was missing. Okay. But the thing is, who is that guy coming for, right? Like, yeah. did any of the guys at the beginning of the show have those helmets? Those helmets were sick, though, with a little eyepiece on them. It was like, uh, those were pretty clever. Some strong military, some coordinated fucking rows going on. Yo, my, my favorite, I like, I really like Leif Erikson. I like, I like, I like, I like his whole vibe, you know what I'm saying? Because the thing is, when they showed the hat first without showing his face, me, I'm like, I'm like, I assume that's a native, uh, a native, that's a, that's a native wearing that, you know? And I'm hearing the story and I'm hearing the story and then he's like, see, this is why I have it. This is why they call me Leif Erickson and all this shit, you know what I'm saying? I'm all <laughs> And the thing is like, a lot of those names are like real from like the myth mythological times, right? Yeah. Like, yeah. And I wonder if Thorfinn is the son of Thor, you know? I, I don't, I don't know I what Thor I wonder what the Thor daughter's name, do we know the daughter's name? No. Freya? Oh, yeah, yeah, it's true, it's true. Or Fia, yeah. Something with a V. V of Fia. And then the, the wife's name is? Helga. Helga, yes, that's right, that's right. Helga. Thorfinn, Helga, Thors, Halfdan, Leaf. We know quite a few characters so far. Man. But, man, that, that, like, just to begin like that, like, I thought the story was pretty sick o already up until this point, mm -hmm. and then for, it to, for them to end off with fucking Max Headroom over here, I'm like, yo, that's pr that's that's uh, especially the ship and the, the form. And the thing is, they showed how formidable Thor's was 15 years ago, yeah. right? Yeah. Hopping through ships, maybe he's less formidable, maybe he's more formidable. But I mean, there is clearly somebody uh, on the seas who is coming to ha incite Wreak some type of conflict. You know exactly. what I'm saying? It's like antagonist meet protagonist. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like, much. but I like the way they set that up. I like the way that they they think and they live like. Off the land and yeah, yeah it's, it's that's the way to live it. But like and the uh, and I love I love the primitiveness of the like they fight with swords and uh, the the way he was pouring the lacquer on the ship to make sure it's not waterproof. Like that's old school, old school shit, right? That's it. And it was what a thousand and two Iceland. So oh, man. those kids, man. They were not going to let him go. Oh, shit. They were not no. going to let him go with that bullshit. They, they knew too much. They could smell bullshit from a mile away. My grandfather told me this. My grandfather told me this. <laughs> You're useless in battle. Why? And it's like, what? Is that what you guys call me? Like, that's a fake warrior hat. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, man. You're like, see, this is the pipe and this is the hat that it came with. That was gifted to him. I, so how, one, much, how much how much truth was in that story? How much truth was in that story, <laughs> if any, right? Like, if anything, yeah. The okay, the one story I did believe though was the the one where they were the man got caught in the friggin' oh shit yeah the the, the ice 
babe. Oh man, that really sucks. Could you imagine walking the sea, babe? And the thing is, like when we used to watch those um, ice truck guys. No, the the ships where they used to kill the freaking. Oh shit! What is that shipping? Not sh- sailing wars. But anyway, when we used to watch it, like we used to see the boats going at 660 knots and then the guys would be like, okay, so how long will you be at the destination? They're like 13 hours, bro. So you see how much territory they cover and at the speed they cover. And you're telling me, even with that primitive technology, as slow as they were going, they didn't even have a boat. They had to walk across the sea. You knew death was inevitable, but how, how he even, how he even managed. Yeah, that's pretty crazy. And the thing is, now... Is it called Sea Shepherds? Sea Shepherds, yes. Was, that was a group of people who were fighting the, the Japanese har, um, whaling wave. vessels. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Do, I wonder if Leaf is one of those guys who tells us... St- like, you know how, like, um, people, like, in, instead of... Like, people who are effective educators, instead of, instead of telling you, don't do, don't do, they'll give you a scenario. You know, when I was a kid, no, 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 no. So maybe Leaf is just a, I'm, I'm just guessing, maybe Leaf is just a storyteller who has a story for every situation. Mm-hmm. Oh, if you want a kid to be precautious, if you want a kid to be brave, if you want a thing to be, you know, one day I picked up a stick and I fought off a line, you know what I'm saying? Like He's the leader of the Boy Scouts, basically. No, but I'm saying, like, just a, the, a storyteller, yeah. just a basic a storyteller, you know what I'm saying? Or maybe those stories were true, because that one, the second one the c1 was that was sad that was sad because when he said we started to eat i was like bro i thought he was gonna say each other other. yeah yeah, yeah. and he's like no we have to eat ice to to think ward off their hunger oh my god and 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 honestly telling a child that you ate your fucking colleagues would be one hell of a fucking but maybe that's what he actually did have to do but he's like that's a story to say oh i i was in the end, I was the last one. Because if there's one thing we're sure of, it's, it's him changing stories. You exactly. know what I'm saying? <laughs> Just by the way them kids were going at him, <laughs> you could tell he was changing some kind of story. Around. Something wasn't sitting well. I, and I love how, like, how like they went from so wide-eyed, optimistic, and, you know, I want to go on your ship with you, to liar, liar. <laughs> <laughs> it turned on him so quick. The kid swooped it in and said, so bullshit. <laughs> Bro. And that's it. Like, I know tomorrow night's performance might not have as many attendants if his show keeps going this way, you know? If the reviews keep coming out. <laughs> Leif Eric uh, Erickson. No, I love, I love just his disposition, you know? And that fucking Dr. Uh, thing mustache from Sonic is crazy. The way it expands like that. Dr. Robot, it looks like what was his it name? Lo- Doctor Robot or Robotnik? Robotnik. Yeah, and Robotnik. He, it looks like an equal. It looks like a like a greater, greater than and less than. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I'm saying? It was like you're doing a math example, but that shit was hype, yeah. man. A good recommended series, and glad yeah. we got down the first one. Anything yeah. else you'd like to add for no, people? No, we gotta get watch more. Let's so, see. thank you all for joining us for the first episode of Vinland Saga. Be sure to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to like the video. Let us know what you thought of the episode down in the comments, and be sure to go over to our Patreon and check out our full-length uncut reaction, or to support our channel. I'm Shady. And I'm Drake. For Greeting the Beer, we're signing off with the next one. Peace. Peace.